Hi, welcome to another video tutorial. Today we're going to look at how to share or divide a quantity in a given ratio. So here's the first problem. I want to divide 250 in the ratio of 3 to 2. So the first thing you're going to do is take the 250 and you're going to divide it by the total number of parts. And to find the total number of parts, you need to add the 3 and the 2 together. So, step 1, find the total parts uh, by adding Three plus two together. So we have five parts in total. Next, so step number two, I'm going to divide the amount that I have. So in our case, I'm going to do 250 and I'm going to divide it by the five parts that I have, the total number of parts. So 250 divided by 5. How much is that equal to? And we know that this is, this is equal to 50. So this 50 represents one part. And finally, once I have one part, all I need to do is <coughs> use this answer to figure out how much the three parts represent and how much the two parts represent. So, step three, I'm going to do 50 times 3, which gives me 150. So, the three parts represents 150. And I'm going to do 50 times 2, and that gives me 100. So, if I want to share 250 in the ratio of 3 to 2, then I would have to have 150 to 100 if I want to share it equally and fairly. I hope that makes sense. Now, what I want you to do is try a question on your own. So, pause this video and see if you can do this one. After completing the question, replay the video and check the answer. So, to work out how to share 4 hours in the ratio of 5 to 3, I'm going to do step number 1. I'm going to find the total parts, so 5 plus 3, which gives me 8. Step number 2, I'm going to do the 4 hours, and I'm going to divide that by 8, which gives me 0 0.5, or half. And step number 3, I'm going to multiply my answer, which is 0 0.5, or half by the part which is 5 and 3. So I'm going to do 0 0.5 times 5. So that gives me 2.5. And I'm going to do 0 0.5 times 3. And that gives me 1.5. And so finally, my answer is 2.5 to 1.5. If you got yourself the right answer, give yourself a, <coughs> a tick. And let's move over to another example. Um, so here I've got um, one meter that I want to divide in the ratio of 2 to 3 to 5. And you will notice that instead of having just two parts, I have three parts. But the technique is exactly the same. So step number one, I'm going to add all the parts together, so 2 plus 3 plus 5, and that gives me 10. Step number 2, I'm going to do 1 meter divided by 10, and that gives me 0 0.1. Next, I'm going to multiply my answer, which is 0 0.1, by 2, so 0 0.1 times 2, I'm going to do 0 0.1 times 3, 
and I'm going to do 0 0.1 times 5 and um, 2 times 0 0.1 is 0 0.2 uh, 3 times 0 0.1 is 0 0.3 and 5 times 0 0.1 is 0 0.5 so my final answer is 0 0.2 to 0 0.3 to 0 0.5 you can also write it as a fraction if you want to and um, 0 0.2 is the same thing as 2 over 10. 0 0.3 is the same thing as 3 over 10. And 0 0.5 is the same thing as 5 over 10. And that's my answer. I hope that helps, and I'll see you in another video tutorial. Bye bye.